Welcome to Goinkins Tier English Class Week Thirteen Day One. In today's class, we are going to do an activity based on countable and uncountable nouns. We have already done countable and uncountable nouns. Countable nouns are nouns that can be counted. Any noun that can be counted is called countable nouns. They have both singular and plural form in it, and we can put numbers in front. For example, one boy. Three boys. We can put number in front, and they have both singular and plural format. Now, uncountable noun nouns that cannot be counted are called uncountable nouns. So, the nouns that we cannot count, we call them uncountable nouns. For example, water. We cannot count water. Salt. Sugar. Juice. We cannot count them, and they only have singular form in it. Uncountable noun only have singular form, no plural form in it, and we cannot put any numbers in front. So, before starting with the exercise, let me all tell you: this exercise needs to be done. This activity needs to be done in your English grammar notebook. English grammar notebook. You have to put date on top. You have to mention your page number. You have to maintain your index as you do all the time. Very good. So now let's start with the activity. What is this activity? Here we have been given some words. So we have to read the words carefully and see which word belongs to which jar. We have two jars here: countable jar. Uncountable jar. So these words needs to go in those jars. So let's read the word. Let's read some words and see where they belong to. Number one, egg. Is egg countable? If it's countable, it can go in countable jar. And if it's uncountable, we put that in uncountable jar. Now think. Can we count eggs? Yes, we do. This goes in countable jar. Another word. Let's try water. Water is it countable or uncountable? Yes, it is uncountable. So it will go in uncountable jar. Similarly, you can read all these words and see where they belong and put those words in the particular jar. Well done. So this was all for today, and I will be back with another session. Till then, everybody, take care and stay safe.